welcome back to MLS Vlogs. Hit this video big thumbs up and subscribe down below. And I hope you guys enjoy this video. We're talking about the difference between shampoo and conditioner and then what products I use after my shower. And what my thoughts are, are my thoughts are um, that I like about them. But the main, th the main thing we're talking about is shampoo and conditioner. Shampoo, condition. So this is the shampoo I use. I use the gene gener genetic, generic tea tree oil shampoo. It compares to Paul Mitchell's tea tree shampoo, but I don't like Paul Mitchell's wine at all. It does not compare to, this stuff does not compare to Paul Mitchell. I don't know why they said that, but it does not compare to Paul Mitchell. I know Paul Mitchell because I used to use it once, my mom. Gave me some stuff and I did not, did not, did not, did not like it. Okay. But this stuff leaves your hair soft and manageable and cleanse hair and scalp of all like the flakiness and stuff like that. I love this stuff. It may not work for you. The only reason why I, the only reason why I, I use it is because it works for me. There, it, the, it is rated a 4.5. Um, which is good in my opinion. There are some bad reviews on it, but try it out for yourself. If you don't like it, go on to something else. Okay, but th this does not have really good ingredients in it. But the only reason why I'm I'm using this product is because I have tried spending three hundred dollars on shampoo and conditioner, two hundred dollars on shampoo and conditioner doesn't work. My hair gets itchy, oily, and it doesn't work. My hair is itchy for weeks on end. Okay. If I don't wash my hair every three days with this stuff, my hair gets super oily and itchy. So I only go, I go every three days and then I wash my hair. But when I do my hair, I try to go four days so that way, my, cause when I crimp my hair, my crimp, my, my, um, when I crimp my hair with my crimper, it looks so nice and then it goes into a natural wavy crimp. And I like that so I try to leave it for four days and then I wash my hair. But by the time they get up, I got, Dandruff flakes and it my scalp is itchy. I if you could just tell I washed my hair today because I um, Waited four days because I'm out of this. I'll be getting more of this um, Friday, I mean not Friday, but Saturday. I'll be getting more of this once my husband's done working and Then I will be And then I when after I use this shampoo I go in with this detoxation they say not to use this detoxation detoxation every day they say for every four to six every four to six weeks but I use it every day every three every three every time I wash so like every three days or every four days um, I use this with it and these bottles usually last me for um, up to um, two months but I ain't gonna explain why it's almost gone that's me I'll, I'm not gonna explain that and um, but like I said I use this and this detox solution removes like all the dead skin and it just decleans your scalp, okay? I never thought I would use something like this, but it works for me. This two products may not work for you together, okay? But I'm not gonna go try this conditioner. I found out conditioner that I like and that helps. If you don't think it's gonna work for you, then don't do it. I think it works for me. I give it a 10 out of 10. Because it's the only product I've ever found in my whole entire life that's ever worked. People say do oil plus. I've tried that. Don't work. People say do this, this, this brand. I've tried that. I have legit spent $500 on products just to try different products. It don't work. The expensive products don't work in my hair. For some odd reason, I need that sulfate in my hair for it to get rid of all that dead skin and stuff. Okay, and then when I come out of the shower, I use this. It's half, it's half coconut oil, five in one leave-in conditioner, nourishing and tangling. But I'm really thinking I don't like it. It does leave, okay. So after I'm done with these two products, my hair is soft already. But when I put this on, it leaves my hair a little harsh. So I'm thinking I'm gonna go back to the Miracle 10. I love It's a Miracle 10. It's just $14 for a little small bottle. So I'm 
So I think I'm gonna have to spend it and I might get the big, big bottle because I don't like it. But I do like this so far. I just started using it like two weeks ago. I'm gonna put a little bit in my hair because I do need it. So I do only, uh, I do like three pumps. And then I just put it at the ends of my hair for the, um, and I do a little bit up here for my, um, so I'll put one more squirt in like that, like, oops, yeah, it does come out a little bit at a time, rub it, and then I just do this, just a quick little, yeah, but I really don't, I don't know if I like this stuff. I was using some other stuff and um, I kind of like that better and I don't know why I got rid of it and I might go back to that with a but usually when I use them it's a miracle 10 I don't need a pro I don't need this afterwards so I'm thinking I'm just gonna get this and use it when I only have flyaways because that's the quickest to get rid of my flyaways so and this is what I use after my shower I do use this comb and I sometimes do use a brush, but today I wanted to... See, now my hair is getting soft again. But the problem is... But the problem is... Is... I don't like that my hair sometimes... Um... My hair sometimes... Um, gets all harsh because of this. I used to really like this product. The only reason why I go to it because uh, it's a good product. It's rated really good. It should, doesn't work on my hair. So I do like it. I will still use it. I, if I run out of something, this is what I'll go to because I don't have a lot of money all the time to go get stuff. And I will use this. But it also doesn't help that I ran out of shampoos. So my hair was a little harsh when I was using this because of... I didn't have a lot of shampoo. And this will make your hair harsh, but it doesn't leave my hair that harsh to where I'm really concerned and that I need to switch. Because at least my hair, awesome. At least my hair, not itchy. Like I'm not itching right now. Yes, I still feel like itching a little bit, but not very bad. But when I use this, it works. I like these products, so I like these products and they work wonders for me. And I use these after the shower every day. I know you're not supposed to, but that's what I do and that's what I found keeps my hair healthy. Because I do, it doesn't matter what I do, you can recommend a product to me, it won't work on my hair. See, now my hair is getting smooth again. Okay, like I said, I don't know like I said, I don't know if I'm going to keep this. I think I'm going to go back to the Miracle 10 and just, and just spend the $14. Because that worked for my hair. And I got it at Walmart. Walgreens, actually. Walgreens, I got it for the first time out. Sorry if you guys hear my son. He's screaming for some odd reason. I don't know why. Um, I got this at Walgreens. For the, um, the It's a Miracle 10 at Walgreens for the first time. And I absolutely loved it. It tangled my hair. My hair was soft. I actually fell in love with it. And I wanted, I got more of it. Because it was only $10 instead of $14. So sorry if you hear the background noises. I can't prevent that. But what I do, what you guys should be doing when you're in the shower is combing your hair with this in the shower. Once you have the conditioner in. I don't, I don't comb when I have the shampoo in. I comb in when I have the conditioner in. And I also use um, one of those uh, scalping uh, scrunchies uh, things for your hair. I use that to help lift up the uh, dandruff so I can get it out. And then I use this. I use a wet brush. This is the wet brush I have. That's what I use on my hair. I don't use it as often as I should. It's a lot harsher than, let's say, this type of brush. I like this type of brush because it... I can go in my hair and it's soft right now because I've already detangled. Yes, it's not, it's an okay brush, but if you're going to choose which one to use, this one's a lot, a lot, a lot harsher. But what you should do, 
because this doesn't really get out tangled that very good. Yes, it does get out tangled, but before you use this to comb the rest of your hair out, use this first and then go in with this. That's what I do. You guys don't have to follow my routines and what I do on my hair. I notice my hair is still growing, it's still healthy, and still thick. My hair used to be super, super thin. I never thought my hair would get back thick again. Because from the products I was using before, when I was up in Michigan, before I came down to Texas, I did not like, I was using Walmart brand. I go to Sally Beauty. Sally Beauty does have natural based, non-sulfate place uh, uh, shampoo, non-sulfate plant-based shampoos if you guys are interested. I use Sally Beauties because I think their products are good. A lot of people say don't go to Sally Beauties, don't go to Sally Beauties. But I'm not going to go to my local salon every day and go run to them and be like, oh hey use this, use that. No, I ain't going to go do that. Okay? I do what's best for me and what I can afford. What I can afford is this. Okay? I can afford this stuff. This is 11 and this is 10. I can afford that. And it works for my hair. It doesn't leave me itchy. It leaves my hair smelling good. Hey, at least I'm washing my hair. There's people out there that don't wash their hair. You guys can choose whatever you want to do. You guys give it a shot. If you guys don't like it, then don't use it. I say if you got, only use, only use this if you got, I say only use these two products together, only if you got dry, itchy scalp. Ain't gonna work if you don't have dry, itchy scalp. It ain't, I'm sorry, but it ain't gonna work if you don't have dry, itchy scalp. Use these two products together and call it good, okay? And you guys don't need to know everything what I do. Yes, my hair is getting soft now. It still may, it may be a little rough. Well, a little rough. But that's because I use this. Like I said, give this a shot and it may work for you. It works sometimes for me. It just depends, okay? I use a lot of my hair and I know that. So what I should be using in my hair instead is my, um, a mir it's a miracle pen. I in the purple bottle. That's what I need to be going back to. That's what I'm going to buy when we get some extra cash. Right now, my husband isn't making a lot of cash right now, which is fine when you get caught back on bills, up on bills first, which is fine. But like I said, these are the products I use. You guys, go ahead and give them a shot. If you guys don't like them, then don't buy them. It doesn't hurt to give a, a, product, a product a shot, okay? It doesn't hurt to give a product a, a shot. Okay, it may work for your hair. This is what I do on a cheap budget. Cause I spend maybe four dollars on this and four and and four dollars on this. Okay. I and I get it at Walmart. If you don't have a Walmart, I'm pretty sure your local drugstore will have it. And if you don't have a Sally Beauty, you can all. If you don't have a Sally Beauty for your shampoo and conditioner, you can always get it online. Go to sallybeauty.com and get it online because Walmart doesn't have that don't have that stuff. Okay? You guys decide what you want to do. You guys want to give it a shot. I ain't looking for other products. I, I found what fits me and fits my hair that I know that, yes, I do have a lot of um, breakage. I do have a lot, but it's a lot better than what it used to be. And I'm going to tell you that straight up. I am, I am going to go back to using It's a Miracle 10 and try a Miracle 10 with this because it's Hask Oregano Oil, Repairing a Hair Oil, and it does work in my hair. I just think it doesn't go well with this. I think I need to go, I'm going to try to go back to It's a Miracle 10, and when I do, I'll give you another review. You guys like these type of reviews? Let me know, and I'll keep doing them. Give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below, and I hope you guys keep coming back. Bye, guys, and stay confident, stay beautiful. Bye.